Hey guys! Today I am doing a Lush haul. I have not filmed many hauls this year at all because I have been doing a budget all year long and budgeting how I spend and what I spend my money on, which has been so amazing and exciting. However, this year, um, just about a week ago, maybe two weeks ago now, we went to um, Indiana to see Michael's grandparents and we on our way back went to Lush Cosmetics and lucky for me I had a gift card there um, and it always works out that way that the year that I decide I can't spend money on things people just give me gift cards. So I am going to show you what I got at Lush Cosmetics and let's jump right in. The first thing I got was oh, the crinkling in the bag. Sorry, I'm doing there. We got this for Michael. It's the robot bomb. It's for kids. Um, it smells so fresh. It doesn't have an overpowering scent, but it just kind of lets off a little fizz in the bath. It'd probably be really fun for kids or fiancés that aren't really into the whole Lush thing, but they're there with you and why not use some of your gift card on them. Next I got this one for my mom. This is the dragon egg. Oh my god, it smells so good. My favorite has been Avo Bath, but this one I think might be my new favorite. I watched videos on it, and when you put it in the water, it shoots out like an orange stream of color. Um, and it's got just really fresh notes to it, a lot of lemongrass, and I just absolutely love this one. Next, I got my Holy Grail. This is the Avo Bomb. It's mostly lemongrass scented. It really wakes you up in the morning. Um, and it just smells amazing. It makes your bath a frothy green color, like a minty color, and it makes me feel like a mermaid whenever I use this one. Next, I got Woosh, and I am so excited about this. This is a shower jelly, and it looks just like it sounds. Um, the first time Michael and I went into Lush, we um, went in San Francisco, and this was just sitting on a table. Um, and it's really cool. It just literally looks like a big thing of jelly. Oh my god, it's so fun. A lot of people cut theirs up. You can use it whole though, um, and it is so fun. It's so citrusy too. I love that Lush, everything that you get there just really like is refreshing and fresh and smells so amazing. Um, so this is just something fun to use, you know, um, something to make you excited in the morning and, you know, obviously you could use it at night too, but, um, yeah, so I absolutely love this stuff, um, the way that it smells and yeah, and I love that it says who prepared it and how long it's good for since it is more of a fresh organic type product. If it says for times when you feel like you're an alien on your own planet, drag yourself out of bed and into the shower with our wobbly citrus wake up call. How funny. So cute. So yeah. Next I had to get this one. I've never seen this anywhere at any of the other Lushes. This is called Honey Bee and you know I miss Beauty Bee. I call everyone Honey Bee. I like to think of myself as Queen Bee even if I'm the only one that thinks of myself as Queen Bee. And this one is just a citrus and honey scented um, balm. It smells amazing. It smells not too much like honey. It just smells very, very fresh. And I am so beyond stoked to use this one. Honey Bee. This is probably the most exciting one that I got. This is the Sparkly Pumpkin Bubble Bar. And I absolutely love this. Look at it. I mean, it is so fun. Michael's nervous that it's going to get all over the bathtub, which it probably will. But that's okay. And it goes with my little theme. Like, I could start it right back there. It just goes on with it awesomely. Um, it does leave a glittery residue on your fingers and everything else. So be careful with that. But yeah, it's just freaking adorable it doesn't smell like pumpkins though i will tell you it just has a very fresh scent um and i'm excited because my favorite bubble bar got discontinued and this one actually smells just like it so yay and the last things we got and michael found these they are um they're to tone your face basically what you do this is what they look like you take this you put it in a bowl of hot steaming water um the lady there said you could boil the water and then put this in you put a towel right over the back of your head and you put your face over it she explained it as a bath bomb for your face which sounds absolutely amazing so this one is just a refresher and it's got little floral pieces in it 
And the other one we got is a toner for your face and it just has a T on it. It looks just like that. And this one I will say out of all the Lush products I've gotten is like pretty crumbly. Um, so yeah, this one's definitely a little more crumbly than the other products, but I'm really excited to use this. This one has tea tree in it, which Michael loves tea tree. So this one will probably be for him. I'm sure we could break it up and do it a couple times, but I think this will be really good for his skin. He's got very nice skin. He moved from the Midwest to Reno, which is where I live. So um, I live in the desert and he moved from somewhere that was humid and had long winters and had a lot of moisture to the desert. So he really needs moisturizing things things and he focuses on his skincare a little bit more because of the huge change that he did make. That is everything I did get from Lush. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'd love to know your favorite Lush products because I'm new to Lush. I've gotten a couple things. I really like Dream Cream. I really like Dream Cream and I really like my Alva Balm. That's my favorite. But if you guys know of any other products that I should try out, please list them down below or tweet me and I would love to know. If you want to hang out with me on social media, I will have everything linked in the down bar below. And this actually looks like I'm wearing a star hat. I don't know if I addressed this. Um, but this is a lamp I got and I love it, but is it too much? Do I look like I am rocking Liberty Spikes way back in the day? Anyways, tell me down below. Follow me on social media. I would love to follow you back on Twitter. We can tweet and talk. I really am liking Periscope lately. So if you are into any of those social medias, if you have anything you want to link it below, I will follow you. We can chit chat. We can talk. Let me also know what videos you would like to see. I know that my, um, I know that my makeup tutorial got quite quite a bit of views and also my planner video got quite a bit of views rather quickly so if you like to see videos like that please let me know and by the way a lot of people ask and I wanted to let you know it's on my lips so this is the Rimmel London Provocalypse in the shade Play With Fire so and then I just put a little bit of Max Cyber on it to deepen it up but yeah well thank you guys so much for watching I love hanging out with you Find me, tweet me, write me on Facebook, follow me. I will have everything linked below and we can hang out. Bye guys.